No directive. Okay, welcome back to Good Morning 38. We are here for the best part of the whole show. We have kitties, they're so close. We are here with Marissa Milford and her friend McClellan of White Oak Animal Rescue. There you go. All right, how long have you been in business? A month. Awesome. And what inspired you to do this? Well, we've always done it, but not on the professional level that we're doing it now. Um, we, I've always done baby squirrels. We've had bats, mice, everything. Okay. <laughs> and, and, and in your backyard? Uh, or you? We, yeah, what do you mean that, bats? Yeah, we, <laughs> talk to us. All the animals that come in uh, stay in our house. Okay. So you you help rescue abandoned little animals. Okay, so now the kittens, and you you've upgraded now. We've got kittens. I understand there's a puppy. There's um, two dogs, an English bulldog and American bulldog pitbull mix, mm -hmm. and we have the two ginger kitties, and those four are up for adoption. Okay. How okay. Old, how old are the puppies? The, or the dogs. The English Bulldog is four. Uh -huh. The American Bulldog mix is, we think, two and a half. She's she wasn't she was a stray, so she's uh, approximation. But the Bulldog was owner surrender, so, so he, he's there, four. The animals just know to show up at your house, or do people bring them? There? Um, <laughs> well, they like they just come and knock in. But it was sometimes they do, right? Well, the, ang the pit bull mix, mm -hmm. the American Bulldog mix. She was dumped on our road. And not a good thing, people. This is not a way to rescue animals. She was yeah, dumped on dump our road her, with another dogs. dog, and we found her home. And she, uh, we, she showed up at animal control about a month later. Oh, so, so the home that you found for her wasn't, wasn't was good. not a good home. We don't know where the other dog is. We've tried to contact people. They're, they've just disappeared. Right. Like their phone number is out of business. Their address is up That's for sale. That's a shame. Yeah. So, okay, so so if they want to adopt these these dogs, how do they contact you? Um, on Facebook, on White Oak Animal Rescue on Facebook. Um, if they do want to contact us, contact us through message, not on a post, because we cannot uh, message somebody personally. They have to message us first. Right. Okay. Good. Okay. So. And um, okay, so now tell us about the kittens, which we're about um, to see. Look how sweet. Look at these little ones. Hey, Hi. Okay, talk to us about them. This one is the more oh. nervous of the two. That <laughs> one's more outgoing. <laughs> but uh, there's Sweet. someone in our neighborhood that has a surplus of cats. <laughs> <A> surplus? <laughs> yes. Uh oh. <laughs> um, is this an old single lady? <laughs> <laughs> hey, watch out. Uh, you're not single. I know. And I'm, you're not I'm old. Dangerously close to being the crazy cat person in my neighborhood. <laughs> but, um, Animal controls actually had to interfere before, and she, she, um, they just kind of show up at her house, and she brings them to her house. Mm -hmm. um, she said we could have. We've talked to her. She says we could have all the kittens, and we, she has two females it's, right now it's a big that job. we're going to Be careful. take to take Be careful. and get spayed. What, their mom, they, the vet says she's only six months old. That's okay. Yeah. Yeah. Wow. Which is right about the time. That, babies have they babies. like to. You come here. Yeah, that they like to spay them. Go. So she probably yeah. got found right oh. before it was she was old enough. And that's important. There's lots of cats. There's lots of dogs. So now, lots what about monitoring and spaying? Are you guys going to offer that service? Or are you going to go try and go um, through Aliqua or? We we use Spay Bay to do our spaying. Spay Bay. Okay. Spay Bay. Okay. Um, we're. We usually don't do the spade and neuter service, but we decided to do it with her because she's on a fixed and it's getting so bad. Kittens running around. They all have feline leukemia, which is right. But these guys, we got to them young enough that they haven't contracted it yet. Perfect. Great. So, so, so you're going to try to take all the cats that yeah, she said. She has a, now, are, do you need? Are you in need of funds? I mean, are you going to try and do yeah, some fundraising? We or? have fundraiser oh, sites, oh, but those yes. are for um, oh, specific go things. We usually keep cash on hand for vet visits and things like that. We are in need of cash donations. Sure. So how can we do um, that? To say, through the same way, just through Facebook, or do you have a website you're going to start, um, maybe? Or like, like I said, Facebook, Facebook, message us on Facebook, mm -hmm. and we can send an address and a phone number. Perfect. Okay, great. Uh, 
We won't do our address publicly because no, if you do your address publicly, yeah. you will have puppies and kittens dropped right. off at no, your We <laughs> understand that. We understand yeah. that. They've already, so, a lot of them have already So go found to their Facebook there, and right? go to, like I said, White Oak Animal White Rescue. Oak. And um, if you want to help Sweet out, time. if you want to send them some donations, I bet they could always use cat food and dog food and yeah. stuff like that, too. And so, and, yeah. and this is great. Marissa, how old are you? I'll be 13 the 22nd. And McClellan, how old are you? So you're real young. So so this is a big endeavor for you to. Uh, it's summertime and it's a great time to start. Right. Keep so busy all summer. So can your friends help too? Um, a few of our friends do come help, and her sisters are a big help with the kitten. That, see, there was three kittens, mm -hmm. and they fell in love with the one. So yeah, I understand that. <laughs> She's adopted. Yeah, I know. Look how that sweet. That never happen. <laughs> <laughs> uh, we call it foster failure when uh -oh. you're fostering and then and you can't give it up, it right? So, I bet. Uh, yes, right. it's our foster failure. <laughs> well, thanks for being a young hero of the community, yeah, and good luck great. to you. And you help them what? out. Go find them on Facebook and help them out, and um, send some funds I mean, or adopt sweet. some kittens. And believe me, this one is adorable. I know they're Trust me. they are, and and you know with feral cats when they show up, a lot of times you don't know, but the sooner you get them and you can play with them and touch them, the tamer they get. And look at them. I mean, these guys are just perfect. They're right. Not, you know. All right, still ladies. fine because we don't have toys, but. Good luck to table. you in your, in yeah, the whole thing. And uh, come find Good these ladies. And, okay, guys, mm -hmm. looks like it's time to go because this kitty, Ginger Kitty. Yeah, we're almost. Says, I'm ready for it to go. So, <laughs> thanks for joining us here on 38 Television. 38 what? Huh? Yes. 38 30 Television. Thank you for joining us at Good Morning 38. Uh-huh, we're with it today. And uh, check us out on uh, www.38.tv. You can find us 24-7. Have a great week. Yeah. Thanks for watching. Bye. <laughs> Thank you.